Okay, so here is the LF606. It does say HD camera. This does not have the camera. This version is just the drone. No camera, no Wi-Fi. And looking around in this box, I'm not sure who even makes this. It just has an item number. Let's do a quick unboxing, see everything that comes inside. And then we will take this out and fly it around. Here is what comes in the pack. So we have this little pack here. It has a USB charger. It has a few spare propellers. And then it also has prop guards. I tend to take the prop guards off mainly because I fly outside and also because they add a little bit of weight to the drone and it kills the battery just a little bit faster. Here's the controller. As you can see, it's non-altitude hold. In the box, there is your instruction. So let's get this little guy out of the pack. It is a proprietary battery. Pretty neat little drone. And uh, I can't wait to charge this battery up and fly it. So to install the prop guard, it's really easy. You just come down here from the bottom and push up as high as you can go. And that's what it looks like with all the prop guards on. So we just gotta get this charged up and then we can take this outside. the L606 from the unknown company. I have no idea who makes it, but it is sold on GearBest. Link is in the description below. So to turn it on, you just hold this power button in on the top and you'll see a red LED flashing inside there. Push the power button on the controller and it auto binds. There's no up, down to bind. Okay, got to trim it out. There we go, we got a good trim there. Not quite, there we go. That's fairly good. So these buttons here are your forward, backward trim. And then over here, well this is for your tricks. So watch as I hit this top shoulder button and I'll hit back and, well that was a nice flip there. Let's do front flip. Oh wow, these flips are pretty tight. <laughs> Let's do a, a roll to the left, a roll to the right. Yeah, this thing flips pretty nice. So it has um, three speeds on it. You hear the two beeps there, I press this shoulder button. There's three beeps, there's three different rates. So there's the first beep. Let's show you the first, the first rate here. Let's get it going at its top speed here. So that's a good beginner speed there. Now let's let's do the second rate, a little more of an intermediate rate. You can definitely tell a speed increase there. Let's try the third rate. So there's three beeps. So you can tell a difference in the three speeds. It's just, there. it's not a crazy uh, change. Uh, it's pretty quick, but it's not the fastest foldable drone that I had. I've had some faster ones on the channel, but still pretty, pretty good drone. Let's do some flips. Another front flip. Let's do a back flip. Oh! <laughs> I don't know what happened there. Maybe I did my flip too quick, I don't know. But it, uh, it could not recover from that.
That was me. I left off the throttle there. It just kind of killed it in midair, but was able to save it. Yeah, I'm impressed with these really tight flips. They just, it loses zero altitude. That LED is, is pretty bright, which is nice because you can definitely see it then. Okay, let's try this one key return. Let's get it up here above the tree so you can see it. One key return. And, well, <laughs> it, it came towards me. Just testing out the yaw right there. That was in the third rate. In the advanced, I guess you'd call it. And this thing's been flying around for a while. So, oh, that's what I want to do. Let's go up here, see what happens if I turn the controller off. See if it'll land. There it comes, and there it goes. It, this is a pretty good drone. Like, it's pretty good. And I think we're about to die. It, it seems like the battery is dying. Let's try to do a flip. Nope, it won't even do a flip. So that means that the battery is just about dead. So it doesn't even change speeds. You can't even go into a higher rate. Oh, there we go. Never mind. <laughs> just made a liar out of me. There we go. There's the third rate. Uh, so let's fly this around. Well, I guess we're not going to because it seems like there's not much life left in it. And here it comes. And that is it. That's the, the battery life right there. So there it was. You saw the LF606. And it's a pretty good drone for the price. Like I said before, I'm going to leave a link down in the description below. But I hope to see you with the next Ready to Run RC. Thank you.